So what do I do on nights that I'm very bored? I sit here and I play Doom on my phone for a little bit. Or some other id software games, since you can pretty much run them all off your phone. And what you're looking at is not what I'm actually playing, that's just a live wallpaper. But it is kind of interesting since it's all AI based. It's not a recording, it's actually running around killing the demons and whatnot as you uh, see it. Um, eventually he will die and then you can toss in stuff like that by hitting the screen. Give him guns and whatnot. Um, you can even control the characters and play a little mini game and modify things, add wallpapers, backgrounds to it. That's a little Doom guy running around on a two-dimensional desktop. But this is my Note 3. It's uh, rooted, unlocked, running KitKat. Um, let's see here. I always, almost never keep anything. So you can see. I keep everything minimized. This is all you ever really see on my screen. But um, moving on, there's Doom 3, D3, 4A. That's Doom 3 for Android. You only get 15 or 20 frames per second in that. Um, Doom Touch is what I'm going to play here in a little bit. Um, Quake 2, Quake 3, Quake. Wolfenstein 3D. That's fun as shit to play too. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see here. And let's see, we'll start some Doom Touch here. Instead of doing the software renderer where everything looks pixelated, we'll use the more updated OpenGL ES. PR Boom, because I don't think Chocolate Doom supports that, so you've got to use. We'll go to the Doom WAD. Platoonian TOT are Final Doom. There's Doom 2, and here's Ultimate Doom. Start Doom. Turn up the volume a little bit. the shit out of the game. You can change the area that your thumb moves around, you can remap all buttons, graphics, everything else like that. Um, how you look around and stuff. And you can tell that it looks a lot cleaner and smoother than it did uh, with increased resolution over the 1993 version just because I selected the OpenGL mode. You can even bring up a keyboard so you can uh, use cheat codes and stuff. And everything is here if you go to the options menu. Kind of went in the back way here, but it's, that's how I do it. Backdoor strunk. Down to three health, I better not die, which I just fucking did. How about that? Anyway. Do a level that I was already working on.
cacodemon. Cacodemon. It's. I keep hitting that thumb button to shoot. Bear in a hill. Wow, well, how I even survived that, I don't know. Damn it, blew myself up. Oh. The mouse look wouldn't help me, so I'm not even going to turn it on. But this is a source port, this is PR boom for Android. So you get all these new graphics features and options and everything else. That's how they add rift support and mouse look and jump and everything else. A lot of fat, a lot of good that did, man. The fact that I can control this as well as I do on a touch screen is pretty impressive. Wolfenstein. I still got time. I got 20 seconds. Guess I might have to do Wolfenstein in another game. Let's see here.